Okay, now let's proceed with the calculation speed. So I'm still here in the light scene 1 and I'll go now to the setting. I'll say fast. Let's see how it looks when I say it's fast. And let's calculate. I'll put the timing. Now it's 7.02 p.m. here. And let's see how long it will take to render. I selected the fast and later we will select the regular one. Okay, so it's 7.09. So it's only 7 minutes, but I received this message. An error occurred while calculating. Oopsie. So what does it mean? I received this error uh, always before the Dialux 8.2. Now again, it's coming. So what to do with this one? I think I need to reinstall it again. Because this... Uh, reinstalling is my only solution before so I need to do it also maybe here in EVO 9.0 okay so let's just ignore it for a while maybe it's not working if it's uh, fast let's go to the standard okay and let's run it again so now it's 710 and let's see how it goes okay so for the regular calculation it's working look at that amazing okay I want I am wondering why the other one is not working properly okay let's just wait for a few more minutes until it finished because maybe it will hung or yeah so let's just wait for that one and now it's gone I don't know what happened that actually was gone. Oh my god. Without saving, without... Where is it? Okay, so that last Evo is gone and I think there's a problem with the software really. So what I'm going to do is I will uninstall it now. And install. And install using in the control panel. And then what I need to do is to close my antivirus yes at least for let's say one hour okay and the other one is the firewall which i need to also close my firewall because sometimes this is where the uh, problems comes because i need to close the firewall okay off and off say yes Okay, and then I will come back to you later. So let's go now and uninstall this Dialux Evo. And uh, install it again later. Okay. So I'll go, now, go back now to my folder and I will install it again. Yes, finish and then refresh, refresh. Yep, right click, run as administrator. Let's install it again because something is wrong with the file, I'm sure. And yeah, that's how I do that. And let's see later what, ha what will happen if everything is successful. Okay, let's install it again. Okay, so it's finished installing. I'll go back now and open it again. Refresh. And see what happened to our Dialux Evo. Now, I think I need to turn on my firewall. Because I, I did not receive any notification saying something is wrong with the installation. So, I'll turn it on now. And I'll say yes. Even my um, shield control. I'll enable it now okay so I'll say lighting design firm and then send and I'll again open this one <laughs> and I hope it renders because um, again it will take time the last time it's 710 we started rendering 710 and it ends 738 so it's 28 minutes rendering for that small villa with lots of not so much lots with a little of trees and objects 
and for the sh the fast calculation it only took 10 minutes or 7 minutes I think and yeah so let's try again I hope it's it will work properly this time okay so it's open now without any errors let's go and try it again using the regular settings standard blah 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 okay so now it's 829 and let's let's go and calculate it okay so it is done rendering and it took almost 30 minutes to finish this one amazing now there's no error the last evo is really looking really cool i think it's just the same i think the only difference really is the uh, calculation report output and that's it but everything is the same except of course the tabs on the horizontal is changed the project tab is here now compared it's not there before okay so how about um yeah i think it's same yeah it looks good all right uh how about the ray tracing or exporting previously i created some um ray trace images and these are the uh the these are the export or the result and let's try one here for example let's see how fast it will render say for example this view where's my favorite view this one okay let's render this one and say for example um ray trace size is 104 and let's start okay so ray trace calculation takes a little time well at sometimes it depends on the angle of the one you're trying to ray trace so i think it's also same nothing special okay i think the last evo is okay and i hope everything is also fine with all of you because for me this is still perfect for my lighting design okay so see you again on the next video and if you want to enroll now in my dialux um advance in udemy it's about to publish soon so just watch out for that one and i will be holding a training an online training this coming april 17 so if you want to enroll just go and visit my website www.enrocolightingdesign.com and go to shop tab and then select the dialux evo 9.0 basics online training all right so see you again in the next video. Bye.